Hello, hello, hi Ezekiel. Merry Christmas. It's happy to see everyone as well. Uh, is it gonna pop up a game? There we go. Here we go. Hopefully it's not too loud. Let me know if it's too loud, okay? Happy Merry Christmas, everyone. Today we're playing... I think it's like <laughs> a Santa Claus dating sim, but Santa Claus is a teen girl. It's called Adolescent Santa Claus. So, if you're interested, let's play! It, it's not a very long game. I think it's like half an hour, but since I'm gonna... Well, I think it has voice acting, but it's not in English. Christmas Eve. Wait, let me see. Um, what is extra? I don't want to do anything that's... Okay, no, I don't want that. Alright, well, let's play. <clears throat> Christmas Eve. I was sitting there, staring into space. My room was without a sound, without color, without smell. Why did people make such a big deal about Christmas anyway? There was no difference between today and any other in any of the other days I'd already sat through. I let out a long sigh. <sighs> Thinking back, I actually believed in Santa when I was a little kid. Santa. Isn't it good if your room doesn't smell? Well, it also doesn't smell like with happiness or... <laughs> It doesn't smell like Santa. Not coming tonight? I don't think he'll be stopping by. Is it because I'm not a little kid anymore? <sighs> okay, now we can see it's me talking. I let out another sigh and looked around the room. That's when I saw her. <gasps> oh, there she is! <laughs> Oh, I don't know Korean. Give me a present. There was a little Santa standing there. I just know this bitch is Santa. Sheesh. Oh, she had just, what was that noise? <laughs> she had just appeared out of nowhere asking for a present. The nerve. Where'd she come from anyway? She hadn't been there a second ago. I couldn't really be sure. I didn't really want to think about it either. Uh, I'm sorry, I have nothing to give you. I had no idea where she'd come from, but she was a very cute for Santa. <laughs> There's nothing left for me? Right, I don't have any money or anything. Anything else? I can't exactly give you my computer. My clothes won't fit you. I don't really want to give you any of my books. I really have nothing at all for you. There's nothing at all you can give me? Like what? Maybe a hope or a dream. I don't have any of those either. Oh, she's smiling. Yeah, you really look like you. You doesn't really look like you would. Doesn't really look like you would. Sorry, go find someone else who actually has something to give you. Hmm? Hmm, she said, shooting me an angry sideways glance. I'm not leaving until I get a present. Do as you please. Wait, are we just gonna chill here? <laughs> Alright, whatever. Was this all one big hallucination? Could I be dreaming? The little girl smiled and skipped circles around me. It was Christmas Eve. I couldn't be sure if it really was happening or if it was all just a dream. Putting the reality question aside for a second, this cute little Santa said she wasn't going to leave my side. Oh. I, it, okay, so was that maybe Christmas Eve morning and now it's later? I locked the door. With that, the room became its own little world. 
It was our own little microchasm, unreachable by those outside it. I closed the door because it wasn't a miracle or anything. There only needed to be one of me in this world. What? <laughs> I was fine with being alone, but... Oh, she's back. Santa was still running here and there. She was hopping around, showing no signs of stopping. She was driving me insane. Sit. She sat. I had this feeling as if I told her to shake, she might give me her hand like a little puppy. I decided not to test out that theory. Who are you? Santa. Santa. But you're wearing a school uniform. Credo, Santa -ya. Still, that doesn't change the fact I'm Santa. Somehow, when I'd first laid eyes on her, I had also recognized that she was Santa. Okay, so he's like, why did I think she was Santa, but she is, okay. How had I known that? No clue. However, there are those times when your mind just throws out all thoughts and chases down a feeling instead. Today, I was experiencing that phenomenon firsthand. Christmas Eve. I just wanted to throw out reality and chase after this fantasy for a little while. Hasn't the world kind of given up on Santa? I threw on this uniform and transformed into a pretty little girl to survive. That's why she was wearing that school uniform. How do you like being a pretty little girl? <laughs> Costume play? It feels like cosplay? You must have felt a Santa then. No, no way! Just because I'm wearing this uniform, it doesn't change the fact I'm Santa on the inside. If you're Santa, where's the presents? Santa doesn't normally give out presents. Oh, doesn't Santa normally give out presents? That's what I'm here for. Returns. Returns? Right, I'm here to take back the presents I gave to people when they were little. Why? Oh, they were just on loan. <laughs> what was on loan? All the dreams, the hopes. Maybe some wishes for the future? That kind of stuff. Damn. You just lent those out? Hmm. Yeah, I was thinking of getting them all back with interest, but... But... Everyone's gone bankrupt! Dang, no hopes anywhere! <laughs> Santa's actually a loan shark, what is happening? <laughs> Santa's a little girl, now she's a loan shark. This is all just one big trick. So you're here to collect all the hopes and dreams you've given me. Yeah, I'm here for them all with interest. I'm sorry, I've wasted them all away. <laughs> oh. She took a sudden step back as if I'd shot her with an arrow. I'd startled the poor girl. Cute though. <laughs> you're so cute when you look like you've been shot. You've got a deadline to repay me. A deadline? The 24th and 25th. That's today and tomorrow. If you don't pay me back, I have to give this uniform back to its owner. What happens if you have to return it? <laughs> then Santa's a goner! Uh, huh? Why is that? That's, a... That's right. Mafia loan shark sim. Using this warm... <clears throat> Using this uniform to transform into a little girl is the only way the Santa can keep from going extinct. Um... What a difficult situation we find ourselves in. <laughs> to put it simply... It seemed like she wanted to explain the situation. After Christmas, there isn't a thing that can be done! Today and tomorrow are the most fantastic of days! 
Fantastic. 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 <laughs> oh, she's really cute. Oh, they're okay. They're fantastic then. Sure, fantastic days. Must have held some special power for her. Then you've got only two days to collect your full payment. Yes, it's quite urgent. I'm sorry, though. I've got nothing. <laughs> She's making the noises. Oh, is it the next day yet? Oh, no, not yet. Oh, it is. The sun's coming up. I opened the window and saw the first rays of lights peering over the peeking over the horizon. Hi, Linda. Hello, Ezekiel. The sun has risen on this fantastic day. Sun, 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 sunny day. <laughs> It'll be a bright and sunny Christmas Eve. Uh, not really that fantastic. Hi, Apple Juice. Merry Christmas to you as well. The sun must have hated the snow because it always melted it all away. It burned the snow into non-existence. Poor snow. <laughs> God, what is this game? The warm rays picked on it every year. The sun's a real bully. Reality has a way of being like that too. Santa? Yeah? Where's Rudolph? <laughs> You're lying! Santa, what the fuck? I grilled him up and ate him. Did he? We're not gonna question it. Did he taste good, dog? Alpha, hello, welcome. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> he tasted like tears. Who would imagine why? That's crazy. <laughs> like tears. I was so hungry that I had to eat him. I had to eat my lovely Rudolph because if I didn't, I would have starved to death. You're watching anime and eating? No problem, Ezekiel. Enjoy your lurk. <laughs> was it tasty or not? How did you come to get into such a desperate situation? All of these broke little children are unable to repay me, leaving me broke and penniless myself. Ugh. Rudolph, my poor Rudolph. Ah! I didn't expect Vor in this game. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, lordy. It's... Oh, I don't know if I want to say it. <laughs> but it's alright. Be... Wait. <clears throat> but it'll all be okay because Rudolph is inside me now. And we will be together forever. What in the world? <laughs> How can there be a Santa about Rudolph? Uh, what do you mean? I just walk everywhere. You walk? Rudolph can... Oh. Rudolph could fly. Just because I ate him, that doesn't mean that I can too. Even if I painted my nose red, I'd still have to just walk around everywhere. The first part sounded sus. I know. <laughs> We had a little moment of silence for Rudolph. Everyone, everyone, let's have a little moment of silence for the fact Rudolph got fucking eaten. Alright, let's continue. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> oh, Lord. So, what are you gonna do after today and tomorrow are over? What? With the other 363 days of the year, I normally make hope and dreams. And with those... And with those? I spread them all around on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Santa's so awesome. You sure are. But... 
완전도 무너져 버렸어. But these days, the factory that makes all those hopes and dreams isn't doing too hot either. It got worn down and collapsed in on itself. How'd that happen? <laughs> it's all those bankrupted little brats. They all fired for joint bankruptcy pension. Petition. Sorry. Wow, I'm sure they did. I read Sina. <laughs> pay up! Pay up, pay up, pay up! I'm sorry, I still don't have anything for you. <laughs> Her noises are kind of hard to make. What is this game? Lindo, this is Adolescent Santa Claus, my guy. <laughs> I thought it was a dating sim, but I think Santa's going through some stuff. Morning has run its course and afternoon is already here. Afternoon. Oh, afternoon. I wanted snow. I wanted to see blankets of snow, white snow. I wanted to see the whole world turn white. She's not gonna eat. I have no idea how this game ends. <laughs> Take off for a while, Mr. Sun. Bring back the snow. I'm hungry. Santa looked like she was starving. I mean, she literally ate Rudolph, so. You're hungry? Oh, stop with the boar stuff. Rudolph says, oh, sorry. <clears throat> Rudolph says he's hungry too. I can hear him whining inside of me. Rudolph. <laughs> Was he alive? Please stop. Please, can we move forward from this? I've got some ramen. I hate instant food. Then starve. You filthy cheapskate. The loan shark suddenly lashed out at the tatter. What is this game? What is this game? Santa gave me a good whack right on my forehead. One minute till reset. What? Then she hit me so hard that I blacked out for a second and fell back onto my bed. Wow. She's got a one minute past. And I have been reborn. What? What a relief! Look what you did. Were you trying to kill me? I told you it was a fantastic day. You should expect the unexpected on a day like today. I'm 100% she ate you. <laughs> sure, it's a fantastic day, alright. It was a fantastic day for catching me completely off guard. Santa. What? Yeah? Why'd you start lending these wishes and dreams to children? I actually sold them at first. You sold them? Mm, yeah. For how much? For all their despair. Ah, that's nice. Despair? I told them that if they sold all their despair to us, we would fill them with hope. And business was good? <laughs> Somehow, business was actually pretty good. But? But at some point, people just stopped selling us their despair. Huh. Sure, fam. What does that mean? <laughs> they wanted to let it go, but they just couldn't. Why not? They were holding on to it for dear life, screaming that it wouldn't come off. Huh. That's why we started lending them our hopes and dreams. Huh. I don't understand any of that. <laughs> why didn't you just give the hopes and dreams to them? If you give someone a dream, they'll just throw it away. Huh. Oh. You did the same! You did me to all the same! She hit me again? God. <laughs> again, she smacked me on my forehead. She hit me so hard I almost fell over again. Let's just keep going with your story. If, the, if you give dreams to people, they just throw them away. 
So why are you, why? That's why you're making a point that you're just lending them out. Mm. That's right. And with all the interest, I figured that we'd make for some great returns. Huh. But all you humans are flat broke. Ugh. Give it back! Give me! I'm sorry, I still have nothing. <laughs> I never make weird noises like this. <laughs> oh, gosh. Afternoon left us and the sun returned to its home. Since we were just sitting here in my room, it wasn't, uh, it wasn't like it made much of a difference anyway. I poured Santa a glass of water. Is there a problem with the water? Stop talking about Rudolph inside you! Please, please, for the love of God. Rudolph is crying inside. He says, you think that the minerals in his water are enough to satisfy Santa's appetite? Rudolph. Considering his circumstances, he was being a little picky. Please, please, Santa. What? Yeah? What are you going to do now? Since everyone's basically bankrupt, there must be some other way to save you, no? Mm. Mm. Well, help me think of something. Huh. We sat there in silence for a while, thinking of a plan. I have no idea. I really thought this whole lending business was a brilliant idea. Aren't you being a little greedy about all of this? With the whole interest thing? Santa's angry. You filthy little cheapskate! Ten years ago, you made me a pinky promise that you'd multiply the hope I gave you by a hundred or a thousand times! You even closed the deal with a spit shake! This Santa girl? She must have really been holding on to this grudge for a while now. <laughs> pay me back! Give it! You made me a promise to pay back an investment of a hundred or a thousand times! I'm sorry, it was all just blown away. I've got nothing. <laughs> oh, again, it looked like you had struck a bad chord somewhere inside Santa. <laughs> oh, seriously, what am I going to do? Santa was getting really distraught, distraught, distraught over all this. <laughs> Before she goes, how oh, happy I have headphones. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. She's making weird noises. Santa, day's already passed, and in just a second, Christmas Eve's going to be over. <laughs> and it's gone. Do I need to cry for you guys? I feel like we're good. We're good. <laughs> Oh, sorry, Santa. This whole game is saucy. I don't know what's going on, but it's fine. And just like that, Christmas was here. I opened my window just a tiny bit and saw that it was snowing outside. Wow, it's finally snowing. It was snowing quite hard, actually. When I opened my eyes tomorrow, the whole world would be covered in white, huh? Santa, are you going to just stay up all the whole night? No, children need an early bedtime. Well, I'm an adult now. Uh, that's where you're wrong. Like, just like Santa's just dressed up in his uniform. You're just a little kid dressed like an adult. Dressed up? 
하는 언제나 산타야. <laughs> 잘 자. Appearances aren't important. It's what's inside that counts. And I'll always be Santa inside. <laughs> Sleep well. Hmm. Sure. Santa lie down and pull the covers up over her waist. And I did the- Are we sleeping together? Oh shit, boys! Santa's in my bed! Somehow we managed to use the same covers. Sweet dream, Santa. Honey dream, Sonia. May your dreams be as sweet as honey, little boy. Good night, Santa. <laughs> oh, it's Christmas Day. Santa, wake up. Oh, we're outside. Are we having a dream or are we outside? I wouldn't let my eyes a third near me. <laughs> December 25th, it was Christmas. The world was white and pure. The murderous sun was hanging in the sky, doing its best to try and change that fact. It was murdering the snow, one snowflake at a time. Santa? What? Yeah? Get rid of the sun. <laughs> Does Santa have that ability? Santa can't just wipe the sun away? Since it's one of your fantastic days, you can manage that, right? Ask it yourself. Hey, Mr. Sun, go home! Uh. <laughs> it's ignoring me. That's reality for you. Ugh. Santa starts rolling a ball into a uh, snow into ball. Santa, what are you up to? I'm making a snowman. Uh huh. I started rolling out my own little snowball. We're making a snowman together. Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. Roll it up, roll it up, roll. The little snowball is all done. Santa had made a larger snowball for the snowman's body. I put my smaller snowball on top of the larger one. Oh, look at him! Wow! With a few final touches, the snowman was complete. How's it look? If we leave him here, the sun's going to murder him, too. Yeah, you're right. Oh. He's got a day to live his life. Just one day. A day to shine is a little beacon of hope. Tomorrow he'll be melted into a little puddle. He'll shine brightly while he's here, but he'll be forgotten once he melts. It'll be like he never existed in the first place. Ugh. <sighs> Seriously? What am I to do? Santa stole a little glance at me. There were only 14 hours left until Christmas was gone. There was only 14 hours left of her fantastic day. Her hope had only 14 hours left to live as well. Once day was gone, she would also melt away. We had to figure out a way of keeping her around before that happened. How about we keep our little ball of hope in the freezer? Then he'll be a little... Then the little guy will never be able to grow up. He'll just get hard and freeze up how he is now. What's your idea then? Santa looked depressed. Is there really nothing to be done? Santa gave me another look. I can't give away these hopes. I can't sell them. I can't lend them out. Being Santa is hard. There's not a silver lining to be found. Yeah. I'm the last Santa. Huh? I told you that Santa's going extinct. I am the last Santa in existence. 
Who killed them? Who killed off the rest of them? You did! You filthy debtors! The creditor lashed out at her debtor again. Oh, she hit me again! Oh my god. She caught me for a legitimate uppercut to the chin. Ouch. That really hurt. It's nothing compared to what you owe me. Ugh. I've been thinking for the last hour or so. I haven't had a single hot thought for that last hour. I've just been rolling up a little ball. You come up with a good idea? Um, I've got an idea, but I'm not sure it's any good. What is it? How about we go on strike in front of the district office? <laughs> what do you mean go on strike? How would that help? What are we striking against? What is wrong with her? <laughs> Is it gonna, what are we? How about we don't? <laughs> oh, she's like, cause she didn't get her wages back or whatever. Why? Giving out all those hopes and dreams is a form of manual labor too. No one will understand. <laughs> Sorry, Santa. Oh, lordy. Oh no, we're back home! How long does Santa have left to live? The afternoon made way for the evening. We headed back into my room. Santa, it's already evening. <sighs> God, Santa, chill. <laughs> Why does it have to be a uniform that saves you? Can't you just cosplay as something else? If I wear this, I'll be a teenager forever! A teenager? I'll be Santa on the inside, but I'll forever look like a teenager because of this uniform. Uh-huh. Why don't you put on a uniform too? What? Well, why are we cosplaying together? <laughs> the next thing I knew, I was wearing my old uniform. Hi, Frappa, how you doing? Hi, Scarab, how you doing? Santa's little anime girl? Yeah, it's really weird. It, I am hoping this game will end soon. <laughs> this whole situation, how strange. It felt like I was back in high school again. Mmm, it looks good on you! Really good! Santa looked quite pleased with herself. Santa's running out of steam. That's why I can't be much of help. Huh? Still, I expect to return with a hunt a thousand percent interest next year. Return on what? Your hopes and dreams. When did I give you my hopes and dreams? They're in the uniform you're wearing. Huh? There were hopes and dreams in this old high school uniform. I think they were inside of you the whole time. They just needed to be drawn out by something. It just takes your time figuring out what they were. It feels like they're all going to melt away and die tomorrow, though. <sighs> Santa? Uh? Yeah? I'm sorry. She's <laughs> <laughs> so yandere. Or, uh, tindere. It's crazy. If you're sorry, then pay up, filthy deadbeat. The creditor lashed out. <laughs> why'd she hit me? Oh, why didn't she hit me this time? Oh, we're moving forward. She just stared at me with an empty look on her face. We've run out of time. For what? There's only one hour left. She was right. There's only one hour left until the end of Christmas. What, where, oh, we have a few hours left till the end of Christmas. You think you'll be able to figure out my hopes and dreams in one hour? <laughs> Santa, I have a favor to ask. What is it, Mr. Debtor? Come back next year. You want me to come back next year? 
Yeah, next year. <sighs> you think you'll be able to pay back the rest by then? Honestly, I'm not too sure. I... <laughs> I'm trying my best to call up my hopes and dreams, but I'm afraid that the sun is going to be so strong tomorrow that they'll all melt away. But if that will ha if that were to happen, I'll just have to wait patiently for them for the next fantastic days. Maybe I can take out another loan then. You filthy little deadbeat! You know how much you already owe me? Uh, how much? I gave you the loan when you were seven years old. You've been accumulating more and more debt for 13 years. So, if I were to pay you back, how much would that be? You'd need to give the hopes and dreams of 13 people to pay off all that. Are you seriously running some sort of pyramid scheme or something? <laughs> Santa's gotta put food on our table, too. What a wicked Santa. Asking me to pay back my loan 13-fold. Good. I'll be back next year. If you haven't given hopes and dreams to 13 people by then... Huh. We have to give dreams to people? Then I'm... Uh... I'm going to call it 130 due to interest. 130 people. And by the next year, if you haven't filled that quota, that'll go up to 1,003 people. 300 people. Oh, the corruption in your enterprise. <laughs> the corrupt entrepreneur laughed and smiled. Good luck. Yep. The North Pole and South Pole will never fully melt. Huh? What? <laughs> if you feel like your resolve starting to melt, just gather up as much as you can and make yourself stronger. And store it all in my freezer? <laughs> what is this game? That'll make it stronger. It'll be too hard to add more resolve to it. Ugh. <laughs> Good luck. Yep. If it's all melted by next year, maybe I'll be nice and let you some more on the next fantastic days. And increase my quota tenfold? That's right. Wow, again, the pyramid scheme, eh? Yeah, wait till your debts get up to hundreds of millions. You're being unfair. That's impossible. <laughs> It's fine, a pyramid can't reach down that far and get stronger. Uh, my short Christmas was already coming to a close. So is she not gonna die? I'm very confused. You'll really be back next year. Mm. Mm. I really have no idea what will happen by then. Well, neither do I. Still. Still what? I'll be ready and waiting. Is that a promise? I don't want to make a promise. I'm too scared of breaking it. Uh, just like a filthy debtor. <laughs> With the tick of a clock, Christmas was gone. You're not leaving? I just have one more thing to say. What is it? Thank you. Huh? Why? Because you were the last. The last what? My last customer. You were my last. Oh. It's a relief, too. I didn't lose my job. Seeing Santa smile like that made me feel somewhat touched. For me, I've got at least 130 hopes and dreams to make before next year. Yep. I'll start easy too With just 13 But I'll be back the next year with 130 Might need someone to help me carry all them by then All of them by then Yeah And the 
next year, a hundred... A uh, thousand three hundred, then thirteen thousand, then one thousand thirty thousand. Wow. 그렇게 되면 공장도 다시 돌릴 수 있어. If I can manage that, maybe I can get the factory started back up again. Santa? Uh? What is your dream? 사람들에게 꿈과 희망을 주는 거야. I just want to give hope and dreams to others. Of course. 그렇지. Of course. Good luck. 너도? You too. Is that the end of the game? Is that how the game ends? Oh! Santa's close to me. Hello, Santa. Oh, she's smiling. Hello, Santa. Christmas was gone. It was the 26th of December. The fantastic days were at an end, but I still felt that ba fantasy burning in my heart. Once I stepped out the door, I had no idea if the sun would burn away those fantastic feelings. Still, 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 I had to open that door. If I just let these feelings freeze in here, they'd stick around, but they'd never grow. I just needed to last one more year. I had to last a year and pass these feelings to others to form hopes and dreams. I was looking forward to the next Christmas already. See you soon, Santa. I'll be waiting. I have almost zero idea what this game was about. I have almost zero idea what that game was about. <laughs> Almost no idea. Almost zero idea what that game was about. Oh dear god. What a wild